Hi, Jason here. I've got another tip or trick for when using a stapler for the staple method of cedar strip uh, boat building. Uh, basically, when you're using a stapler, tendency is the, the stapler will fire the staples through with so much force that you end up getting a, a little divot underneath the, the bottom edge of the staple. So that forces you to do a lot more fairing and sanding of the boat. And even when you're removing the staples, uh, because they're so deep, uh, you, you have to, you know, sometimes dig in a little bit to, to get underneath the staple to pull it out. So today's tip is just to take some masking tape or some other, you know, thick tape. And you can see I've just got it wrapped around my stapler. Uh, the main thing is that we're building up the bottom slightly. Okay, so I'll just bring it closer, you can see. Right, so I've just built up the bottom and I've got enough room there so that I can fire the staple. So basically I lined it up just, uh, the staple gun it has a, you know, a mechanism that, that does this to fire up the staple. So, so that mechanism is still showing and I put the tape just below that. Okay, and now I've done uh, two staples and you probably won't be able to see on the video, but I'll just bring it close and you might be able to see uh, when I bring it in that the the one on this side uh, is slightly raised probably I would say a millimeter higher whereas this one is without the tape uh, is completely uh, fastened down okay so closer not sure if you can see it but anyhow there it is uh, so the benefit there is that I'm not going to get that uh, that divot underneath the stapler or underneath the staple, excuse me, and then to remove the staple, it, it's easy to, you know, get the pliers on and pull it out, or even if it's a, a tough one, to slide something underneath it uh, without scratching up the, the cedar. Okay, cedar's such a soft wood, we want to protect it the best that we can, so this is a, a tip that's just going to save you time in the fairing process later on.